A clear message of a hate is being spread through the Hilliard area. Sometime overnight, five businesses on Empire between Market and Helena were tagged with racial slurs and swastikas. KXOY 4's Tori Brunet live at one of those businesses hit. And Tori, the graffiti, is it still there tonight? Yeah, I'm at Ha Ha's Grill House, and the owner of this restaurant couldn't get it to come off its bricks. So we had to cover it with two layers of plastic. The graffiti spans about eight blocks, and whoever did this targeted everything from fences, signs to businesses. It really looks like anything accessible from the sidewalk. I don't like it. I mean, it's crap. Randy Messner at Abe's Discount Sales had to spend his morning painting over swastikas left on his property. I'd like catch them. You know what I'd do? I'd paint them. See how they like it. Right next door, the owner of a pro auto body shop had the tedious task of wiping off each fence post one by one. Anger. Anger that uh, they used my fence to broadcast their message. John Ha, the owner of Ha Ha's Grill House, couldn't get the graffiti to come off the front of his restaurant, so he had to cover it up. We got hit with bunch of derogatory terms and a swastika. You could see swastikas and racial slurs from Special K's Bar and Grill on Market and Empire all the way to a fence on the corner of Helena and Empire. The business owners say cleaning up the occasional graffiti is part of doing business here, but the message behind this graffiti is new. Every once in a while we'll, we'll get a gang marking. That's about it. Nothing like this. This graffiti sends a clear message of hate leaving people in the neighborhood wondering who is capable of doing something like this. I don't know if it's just kids that are mad at each other or if it is actually a hate group that might have moved into the neighborhood. Spokane County's graffiti unit says they don't have any suspects, but if you see any graffiti, especially something this racially motivated, they are urging you to report it. In Spokane, Tori Brunetti, KXY4 HD News.